this video we will learn how to install the linux mint in our older pc which has ssd and hd we will install the operating system in ssd hard drive and in hd we will use as it as a storage and this is ubuntu based operating system hence it has it is built on the base of ubuntu so we'll click on the download and for my older laptop i can't choose the uh, this version i can i have only choose this one because it is a light simple and efficient you can choose this one also above home i will choose this option and uh, you can choose any world or canada usa as i am from india i am choosing indian one uh, it's working fine for me and we will click it on and we'll download it so download these two software and open the rufus and here here will be the window will come and don't use any card reader or modem just use the pen drive for installation of ios image and select your pen drive here and then from here select the ios image and get ready and press the start button it will erase everything whatever there i uh, recommend choose the and choose the recommended option and you will go to go we will turn on the laptop and press the escape button it's depend upon the manufacturer and f2 for system diagnostic and we'll choose the second option which is usb hard drive then we'll choose the first option start the linux mint here we'll be open the demo environment where we will select the hard disk uh, disk type icon and we'll continue and we'll select the language and connect to the local wifi and as we have two hard disk one hd and one ssd so we will choose something else option as we want to install our os on ssd which is 240 gb and we will select 240 gb as a loader and all these partition we will remove them by selecting minus icon till we will do this till we get the two option 500 gb and 240 gb here we can see that getting two option and from that 240 gb we will take out 512 MB to do uh, another partition we'll select use as as EFI system partition we'll do ok and we will do we will select the 240 SSD 240 GB SSD as our home so so that our os will install in that ssd then same thing we will do the 500 gb hd hard disk we will use it as for storage select the timeline uh, enter your credential your name and username and password you will enter then we go for the installation after installation finish we will open the file manager and we will able to see our all those space disk and when we are trying to click to open them they are not opening and we need to open a hard disk software we will select the 500 gb as hd format it completely and we'll press the plus icon 
and we'll allocate completely 500 GB and we'll keep the name of this disk and it's complete let's open it now it's opening and let's check the property so done we have installed